Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your coach, Coach P. You're on the sideline. All right, in today's play, we're going to look at an intermediate play. Uh, I call this one Xavier. So again, this is an intermediate play. You might want to try this with a higher level team. So I'm thinking more of a high school level and up. You don't want to do this with a beginner's team only because there's a lot of things happening with this uh, with this play. It could be a little bit too complex for them. All right. Now, again, intermediate play. We call this one Xavier. This play will actually give you three great looks into the post for easy scoring opportunities. Now, the key thing on this is this. You want to make sure that your player one, he should be your good ball handler. Your player two should be an outside shooter. Your player three should be a slasher and able to score close to the hoop. And finally, your player five, he should be a good post score. Now, saying all this, let's just take a look at the play and how it's ran. We're going to have a pass right here. So essentially, your player three, uh, just to go back real quick, I failed to mention how we start. We do have a stack position down low on the block. So that's going to be your four and your three. On the opposite block, you're going to have your player five. Your two and one are at the top, right? So remember that you're going to start in the stack and your player five will be opposite. Your player three will come to the top and he's going to look to receive the, uh, the pass from player one. At that point, what's happening is this. Your player one will actually do what we call a V cut. So he's going to penetrate the paint. And then he's going to come back. He's going to look to receive the ball. Your player four will come up to set a screen for your player three. Your player one will dribble to the opposite. That's going to send your player two to do what we call a flare cut. Your player three will look to attack right here down low. What will happen is this, and I'm going to pause it right here so we understand what's taking place. We sent that player three off of that screen to go and curl around your player five. We're looking to see if we can hit up player three. If player three is open... You want to pass to that player. If not, what will happen is this. Your player three will actually clear the lane and he's going to go on the opposite elbow. At that point, your player five will come up. And this is where I was talking about having a great uh, player five to be a really good and strong post player because we can pass the ball to him and we can have player five look to score. If not, we'll simply just pass the ball to player four. That player can look to attack the paint aggressively. He can finish at the hoop or he can dish it to player five, right? So again, we call this one Xavier. It's a little bit complex. That's why I call it intermediate plays just because of that flare cut and stuff like that. Uh, but like always, guys, questions, comments, you guys know exactly what to do. You want to write them down below. You also want to make sure you subscribe to the channel so you never miss any of my videos. Until next time, everybody, from on the sideline, it's your coach with this Xavier play. Ciao for now.